Hello everyone, it's Immature Gamer here and I got a little brief update for you all. Fortnite Battle Royale dropped a brand new game mode called Shooting Test Number 1 and basically it's only out for a limited time and I'm gonna go over everything you're gonna need to know about it, so let's go. Immature Gamer. So last year, Epic Gaming stated some goals they had for Battle Royale's combat and weapon accuracy, and they are finally implementing them. Their first goal was pistol sniping at long range should not be possible, and their second goal they said our weapons should have characteristics that encourage a wide range of engagements based on distance to target, target type, and ammo availability. They have been hearing our concerns and they are trying to find the best way to implement them. I think we all can agree that we've been in a battle and we've been getting one shot, shotgun to the face or something like that, and it's very, very frustrating. So Epic Gaming is just trying to make this game a little more realistic so they are going to be trying out some prototypes. They gave us two examples, uh, first shot accuracy and perfect accuracy plus recoil. And for this model, we're actually just going to be trying out the first prototype, which is the first shot accuracy. And in many ways, this version is very similar to our current experience we've been playing, but they have added a few changes. So let's go over that. Weapons now have first shot accuracy indicated by a red glow on the reticle. This is applied when standing still, aiming not hip firing and aim spread is at peak accuracy basically if you haven't fired recently it is different per weapon headshot critical hits have been reduced shotguns are now 150 percent damage and it was 250 percent and all other weapons with headshot crits are now 200 percent damage they were 250 percent so that should dramatically reduce some of those crazy wild headshot which basically takes you right out of the game Damage falloff has been introduced for some weapons. Damage applies at 100% to a fixed range. Falloff begins at different ranges depending on the weapon and decrease to 70% damage. Sniper rifles, rockets, grenade launchers, and shotguns are unaffected. Basically, you can't be across the map with a pistol, one shot, kill somebody. So that is going to be a very nice adjustment. That'll be very nice when it's actually implemented into the actual game. Other balance adjustments include semi-auto sniper has had its damage increased to 75 damage basically for the epic variant and 78 damage for the legendary variant which before it was 63 for the epic and 66 for the legendary the scoped assault rifle has had its damage increased to 25 damage epic version and 26 damage legendary version it was 23 epic version and 24 damage legendary version and then they added a plus two base damage to all smgs so there you go go try out the new game mode shooting test number one fyi wins and other stuff will count while playing this mode. They did say their intent is to run multiple shooting tests and will be gathering data from many different sources, internal analytics, community sentiment, and various social platforms. So if you guys want to give any concerns or you like the game mode or like what they're doing, go on Reddit or Twitter and let them know guys. Um, they did want our participation. So remember that and go test it out. It is going to be squads. So you have to have play with four people. You can't go play solo or duos. That's that's just an FYI. You can always jump in with another squad. So anyway, go check it out, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'm Immature Gamer, and I'm out. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any new videos. And thank you for watching. Keep the change, you filthy animal.